right, guys, episode number one to Kicking It With Quadro, where I ask you guys to ask me whatever questions you want. Open for them. We answer them here live. So anybody that wants to take part in this, keep an eye out once a week. We will be doing a Q&A. I will post up a story on my Instagram page, and you guys get to openly ask me whatever the hell it is you guys want. I have one of my buddies behind the camera asking me some questions. So we got my boy Joe here today. He's gonna be uh, shouting out rapid fire some of these questions that uh, I'm gonna answer for you guys. So I'll be shouting out the name and the question. All right, first one from Eric. Biggest pet peeves. Hmm. People that don't dry their hands. Pisses me off. Drip all over your fucking floor. Drives me nuts. Um, people that litter. Hate that. Um, People that fucking dick around in the gym. People that sing while they're training. <laughs> people that text while they're training. People that do anything besides training when they're in the gym. <laughs> Pisses me off. <laughs> people that suck at driving. That's enough. That's not gonna fucking angry old man now. People. People. Okay, that's a good one. Largest caliber firearm ever fired from Joel. The the fully Have you shot a 50 cal? Yeah. You have? I shot a fully auto AK. I think it was fucking ridiculous. I was just firing. I was just shooting in the air. It's like higher. It definitely shot some birds that day. Um, I did a lot of hunting growing up, you know? So it, it's, you know, that, that's not high power rifles, you know? I have a Falcor 5.56. I have a Darkstorm V1. I have a 300 Blackout. I would say a 50 cal is probably the biggest one that I've shot. Des it, Desert Eagle. It's a big gun. There's a Desert Eagle 50 cal? Yeah. Is lifting belt and knee sleeves cheating when hitting a squat PR from Kyle? No, it's absolutely not. Absolutely not. It's just, if you just have knee wraps on and a belt, you're just keeping your spine from blowing out your asshole. And the knee sleeves are just protecting your kneecaps. You're not you're not in a full fucking squat suit, so no, it's not cheating. It's more protection. I wear a belt when I train fucking armor for Christ's sakes. So whoever's telling you that, who's this good thing? Kyle. 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 Who's ever telling you that Kyle is a loser? Follow up. Follow up. Knee sleeves versus wraps. Wraps. I've never worn a pair of knee sleeves in the gym my entire life. So I guess I can't really answer that. Are <laughs> truthful? Who is your favorite person on the podcast from uh, TNC something? TNC? That's, that's the person oh, I asked. Like, that's not a podcast I ever fucking been on. Um, favorite? Walker. Most likely I push, pushed off a cliff. Cool ad. <laughs> <laughs> Follow up. <laughs> Are we ever going to meet your sister? Um, what are we? <laughs> Ridiculous. Good um, question, bro. Who was your biggest inspiration when you were a kid from Swoley Mouth? My pops. <laughs> definitely, definitely my dad. My dad was Jack. I thought my dad was like the fucking biggest guy on the planet. Until I started paying attention to fucking wrestling. And then the Hulk. I was obsessed with the Hulk. And then Ninja Turtles. They were Jack. So that's how that evolution happened. From dad to Ninja Turtles. How long have you been bodybuilding? Since 2003. And I retired in 2021. Uh, yeah. Um, Long time. Favorite cheat meal? Pizza. Fight me right now. What kind of pizza? Margarita pie or plain. Come at me, bro. Does any part of you wish you still could be on stage competing at a high level? Um, yeah. I, I think um, I would have liked to have another couple of years in me. Um, I don't think it, it had anything to do with... Um, Honestly, anything besides injuries, my shoulders is what fucking just killed me. Not being able to hit certain poses and train a certain way um, enabled me to grow and enabled me to pose and enabled me to, to be a great bodybuilder. Best food options to maintain your diet while traveling. Uh, that's from fucking Rob. Rob. <laughs> Client Rob. Military Rob. Idiot. <laughs> uh, well, if you have your phone on a diet, then you should be taking all the food with you. So. Bulk cooking. Bulk cook your chicken, steak, carboil your eggs, make your rice, potatoes, and then vacuum seal it all. Bring it on the plane. You can bring uh, food on the plane with you. You can bring um, ice packs on the plane with you as long as they're frozen. So there's really no excuse to not be able to uh, have your food. Call the um, hotel. Ask for a fridge. If they don't have fridges, tell them you need a medical fridge for, you know, uh, medical needs because you're a diabetic. I've done that before in life. People are going to fucking be like, oh, you shouldn't do that. Well, you know what? Sometimes you got to fucking boil the line a little bit when you're trying to be great. <laughs> 212 Olympia top three for this year. <laughs> so, Kamal, Sean. I really want to say Keon, but I just haven't seen him fucking nail his conditioning. And he, he's gone at it a few times. He looks good, though. 
Yeah, but shape only carries you so far. And at the Olympia, shape's not going to carry you that far. Especially with Kamal. Yeah. And Sean. You got to be big and fucking hard. I don't even know a lot of the other guys, to be honest with you. I'm going to say Keon for right now. Because that's honestly, I don't know anybody else. Sean and Kamal are definitely one and two in my book. What do you think? Um, What's your favorite non-mandatory pose? Um, I used to really like a three-quarter back shot. Poor daughter or gay son? <laughs> um, the gay son paints his fingernails and wears eyeliner. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of whore daughter are we talking? Just sleeps around whore? Uh, like, yeah, like community. It's known in the community. But not like paid for money hooker whore. No, this guy, you can't do that to me. Or you find her on a porn site. No, that's dip no. <laughs> <laughs> on a cast of caps that you're on. Or like a or like an OnlyFans or. I don't know, pick one, but I got some follow-ups that I think would be funny for this. I would say whore daughter. <laughs> okay, ready, loose lips, Lucy. <laughs> Four-year-old guy. Four. Your, your your daughter's of legal age, 18, whatever. Okay. Doesn't live with you. And you find out she's got an OnlyFans. What do you do? Call the priest. <laughs> <laughs> Favorite homemade cheat meal? Let's do something that everyone asks every week. Steak, eggs, and uh, hash browns. Where in Italy is your family originally from? Uh, Calabria. Calabrese. Weird. Mayo or ketchup from Jam J? Oh, ketchup. Did we ever figure out if Evan's... Uh, Mayo ordeal was real? It was. He's did, gross. He, he did it again? No, but it was real. Not a question, but thank you for the inspiration on the work ethic. Thank you. Blue collar hashtag. Blue collar hashtag. Jacqueline Cara 1018 on Instagram wants to know how much do you miss me? Who? I don't know. Oh. Someone will find her because of this. <laughs> I'm Yo, Jacqueline, so, so much. First of all, fuck Nike. I wear Adidas shoes and I got you. Just do it to the side, honey. Thank you. John Benjamin. Johnny B. Any thoughts or info on peptides? If you're talking like BPC and like TB and like GHRP6, like I've tried those. I never saw crazy results with them. Um, I do know people that have. I remember uh, when Sean Roden said he took GHRP6, he said his fucking appetite went through the roof. Um, I know people that have great results with BPC and TB. Um, I tried it. I didn't see any results with it. So in a position where you can try it and uh, You know, I'm the, I'm the type of person where I'll I'll try it if I don't see results after a week or two Then I'll stop using it like I'm not gonna continue using something that I'm not yielding a result from because I think that's a waste to, to put something in your body That's not working. So I would say if you have access to it try them and see how they uh, How they do I would just um, I think there's a there, there's a, um, a Website oh, I can't think of Amino Asylum, yep. is that it, yep. .com. Um, I use their stuff before, it's pretty good. So uh, I don't have a code, but I'll throw their thing right here. Um, try that out. Bro, you cover the lens when you're watching porn too from Simone. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not that much of a conspiracy theorist to cover my fucking lens on my camera because I think somebody's gonna videotape me and whack it off. If they wanna see it, have at it. <laughs> we overthink how yeah. much the government gives a shit about. I don't think the government cares about saucy sister Nino fucking bringing one out in his bedroom at midnight. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Uh, are you moving? If so, where and why? Uh, hopefully, yes, Texas. Um, just because I have a lot of connections there, business-wise, tax-wise, um, weather-wise, um, law-wise, hunting-wise, lifestyle-wise, which makes sense. Just call me KC says, how's life, buddy? Simple as that. Everything good besides the sport. Everything is good, my man. Business is great. Training's great. Sponsors are great. Life is good. In the hood. Uh, request for shreds. Do you also look ass as Nick Walker does? I I believe that question was supposed to be. Do you like your ass late like Nick Walker? No, nope. this is uh, lick ass. Yes, but my my point is is that do I lick booty hole? <laughs> Sure do. Okay, does a one-legged duck swim in a circle? Sure does. Okay, but I don't. <laughs> but I do not appreciate my butthole lick. Okay, uh -huh. on any occasion, I don't need no fucking slug. It's slipping its way up there around the old leather cheerio. I'm good. <laughs> Ninety-eight percent of 
percent of men like their asshole. Like the two percent are liars. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. <laughs> Who said that? Is that, is that I think that's right? the stat that I'm just. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's common. Is right. No, that can't be true. <laughs> you write that on uh, Wikipedia. Yeah, that's. You can hook me up to whatever fucking device you want. If like a lie detector, or whatever. I guarantee. <laughs> Do you like your butthole? Like the answer would be no. I think it's more. My than... my heart rate will stay steady. <laughs> <laughs> the confident answer. I won't go any deeper on that. <laughs> That's what scared me. <laughs> First cycle in what age? <sighs> this is gonna be on Trigilli's channel. Twenty one. Fuck everybody. <laughs> Twenty. Guy one. reveals. Twenty. Secret cycle. Twenty one and it was twenty amps of sust. On the drink, 250. Two amps a day, uh, two amps a day, two amps a week. So 500, 500 megs of yes. tests. Yeah, a week. 21. Yeah, for 10 weeks. Gained 17 pounds. First shot I got was from a kid with an insulin needle in the shoulder, and my shoulder blew up the size of a fucking softball and I could die. <laughs> what are you doing, take a room? Say hi to everybody. All right, guys, real bump for the day. Answer everybody's questions. You wanna refresh it just to make sure we didn't miss any? You guys have a fucking rough life. Bodybuilders really have to eat six meals a day. Yes, five. Yes, five to six, depending on the time you get up. Do pitchers really have to practice throwing the ball? Er. <laughs> you want me to? I'll fight you both right here <laughs> on camera. Is there any point to creatine HCL versus monohydrate? HCL, it's just a newer version, better absorption. Creatine monohydrate is one of the more um, readily and most commonly studied supplements, so there's more backing behind that. But uh, creatine HCL has a lot of uh, um, studies behind it, and it's very beneficial. So if you had the choice to pick one, I would definitely say HCL. Is it two? Is two X double patty beef burger with fries plus cookie dough too much for a cheeky dough? Plus cookie dough, what? Ice cream? I don't know. It just says cookie dough. No, probably cookie dough ice cream. No, you're good. Best way for serious companies to reach out to you about sponsorship offers? Supplement companies? I'm, yeah. I'm, I don't know, I'm guessing this, this question is backwards. Say it again. Best way for serious companies to reach out to you about sponsorship offers? I think he's maybe he's trying to ask you if you want a sponsorship offer. No, I, I mean, I mean, <laughs> no, you think he's asking how, how do you get sponsors? Yeah, how, do you, how do you reach out to companies? Don't ever do that. <laughs> ever. Don't ever reach out to a supplement company and ask them if you can be sponsored. That's like begging. Like, nobody does that. Like, nobody begs to, like, you know, go try out for the Giants or nobody begs to be on professional football teams or baseball teams or basketball teams. Nobody begs to be on the Olympics. Nobody nobody begs to get an IP pro card. Like, it, it's, it's earned. Like, sponsorships are earned. They're not given. They're not begged for. So it's actually frowned upon. Like, you, you'll get, like, supplement companies actually, like, talk about the ridiculous emails and messages they get about people that do that, so don't be one of those idiots. You right, Tanker Runes? What do you think about that? Hmm? Idiots or what? Huh? What do you think you're idiots too? Closing it out here, kicking it with Quadra episode one, wrapping it up, Storm and Tank, myself, in Casa de Sistrino, in the podcast room, we're out. Bang. Shut it off, Tony. Tony! I'm sending myself the fucking screenshots. Here. Shut it off! <laughs> fucking cock. Tony, I'll smash your camera. Five. <laughs> four. Three.